When you first start looking into your health, a lot of people gravitate towards supplements. And I think it's this idea that we're kind of given from pharmaceutical industries that when you have an issue, you pop a pill. And I think a lot of people take that same dynamic into a natural environment and go, what herb do I need? What supplements do I need to recover? And, you know, it's all well and good, but if you haven't got the foundations right, it's not really gonna do anything at all. And actually, it could be harming you. And this isn't something I thought about when I was first recovering and filling my cabinets with all sorts of supplements, which was a waste of money, is that these products are not proven safe and effective before they hit Amazon or other shops. They are innocent until proven guilty. And if these supplements you're buying aren't proven to be safe with third party testing of heavy metals and other contaminants, you could actually be hindering your body's ability to heal. So not only are you somebody that maybe potentially hasn't got the foundation of sleep and good food, you could be taking these supplements actually adding a burden to your body that's already struggling. So, if you're struggling with your health, get the foundation down first. That's what you want to be focusing on. And you can add in some supplements if you feel that it, it's necessary. You know, you can add a, a vitamin D supplement if you want, if you're not getting enough sun. It makes sense. But just make sure whatever supplement you're putting in your mouth is from a reputable source that hasn't got any contaminants that could be actually hindering your body's ability to heal.